today we're going to Natural Acres Farm. It's where we buy our beef. We're buying uh, half a cow. No, man, come. And, come. And come. No, you sit there. Girls are always first. Oh, I told you that. Come. Sit. Sit. And um, that's where we're going today. We're going to National Acres. What are you doing there? Get a half of a cow. We eat organically, and naturally, then, we eat organic beef. And this is the second year that I have uh, bought a quarter or a half of a cow for this year from Natural Acres. It's very important to us. We won't eat any other meat just because it's hormone-free and antibiotic-free, and I want to feed them the healthiest possible. It's a gift that I give them, that we give them, and we make sacrifices elsewhere so that we can afford that. Last year was my first time buying, like, beef in bulk, so I didn't even know the cuts I really wanted. I kind of experimented. So by this year, I knew that I, what I needed. Did you buy more ground beef than Doubles. cuts? Doubles. Yeah, so we use a lot of ground beef. It makes the most sense for us to buy half of a cow, and it, I mean, it is very expensive, but in the long run, buying that much you save. Last year at this time, we were still not necessarily using like two pounds of meat at a meal. Now, for a few months now, we've been always using two pounds, so. This will last us, I hope, a year. I'm sure a year. Show us off. Show us on. Okay. I'm just packing lunch for the kids because we're going to be out in the middle of nowhere. Do you have a spare cooler thing, John? No. I can take one out of the big cooler. Yeah, that's what I asked for. No. You asked me if I had a spare one. Could you spare one? That's better. That's not what you asked. Read the list out loud to me. Don't just discard it. This is stuff for today. Apple juice, yeah, I have it in the cooler in the van already. Two things of apple juice? Yes, make sandwiches. You already did that, you're packing them. Get cold packs and, and coolers. Cooler, I got one cooler with cold packs and grapes. Where are the grapes? In there? Okay, yep. This stays over there. John, can you take a deep breath because you're really annoying everybody? Ow. No, put it between your seats to wipe Joel's nose. You want him to sit in the back, you have to maintain him. We're feeding him breakfast in the car because we're leaving early. Yeah. Saves a step. We do this every Sunday morning, door? too. OK, can we feed the kids? They'll be a lot happier. Those food purses are actually, they came with the um, girls' Easter dresses. And anyway, I ended up with six of these little pouches, these drawstring pouches, and we just put dry cereal in them every Sunday morning on the way to church. In a bag. In in a bag, and we clip them to their top clip of their car seat so that I'm not wandering up and down the entire trip handing people their cereal and it's not spilling all over. And it seems to work really well. We open them and they just sit there and munch as they go, and yeah. it works really, really well. I wonder whose idea was that was. That was your idea, honey. It was.